probably there's some work ahead, but do you have deadlines and ETAs? Yeah, that's a great question. Any promises you'd like to make here on the air? <laughs> we, don't, we don't use <laughs> deadlines internally at all, period. And, and that's like kind of a radical thing that people are like, oh, that's very contrarian of you, Quincy. Yeah. Why don't you use deadlines? How do you get things done? Uh, but things get done re- regardless of whether you put a deadline on them. And I've found that things are generally done better if they're not you know, up against this this time pressure that, that results in compromises. Now, I can understand, certainly, the use of deadlines. We happen to have like a really motivated team who just gets things done and, and is very communicative of the state of those things. So we also work in massive parallel. Like I like to call ourselves like the massively parallel organization in the sense that we have so many different threads and nobody's getting blocked by anybody else. If you can take work and you can make it discreet enough and and... Uh, put it on its own thread, then you don't have people blocking one another and you reduce the communication overhead and like, oh, that got done over there. Like, great. But I wasn't waiting on it. It's just, I'm delighted that that's done. Mm -hmm. Oh, that happened. That happened. That happened. You know? So that's a big part of our organizational philosophy is try to figure out ways that we can design the work and spec it out to where nobody else is waiting on this work to be done. And then it can just chip whenever. (laughs) 